All right, guys, welcome back to the videos. I wanted to show you how hot it is today. It is not in the triple digits yet, but we are gonna get another Onyx video on how hot this motor gets. The last time we did this, if you checked out the last video, it was 70 degrees, and I definitely am gonna get one when it's over 100. It is gonna be over 100 today. Actually, it's in the 106, roughly from four to 6 p.m., but right now it's 91. But I'm gonna give you guys a readout. You might not be able to see that on the little Android phone, but I'm just gonna give you the motor temp when we go ride right now, and we're just gonna monitor that. That's all we're gonna do because we put the heat fins and Staterade fluid into this hub. And they're still good and tight. They're just a little dirty because we went into the dirt and everything. I need to wash this bike. So uh, we'll take you for the journey and uh, we're gonna see how it does. Right now we're at 40 for motor temp. We barely left and we're already at 50. This video is just to show people out there if doing the Staterade and the heat fins is worth it for you or not. All right, we are finally at 60. Way up there. Uh, we're at 65. I reset the mileage for you guys so you guys can know where we're at. Sixty-three. So you gotta do it, people. And this is what I do right here too, because this line is always so long. You guys have been seeing it in my videos, like all the time. Wow, this bus is putting off some heat. Holy crap. My body's hot. All right, so we are at 62 to 63. I saw it hit 66, but it's, it's kind of bouncing around. So far, the bike is good. We've almost done two miles. We started at 40. Now we're at like 62. Now it actually went down to 60. Saw 59. Seventy, we're at seventy right now. I'm not trying to go easy on it either. When I get a straightaway, I'm trying to floor it. So obviously we're doing like fifty right now. Forty nine fifty. Parked right now, we're at 75. 74, 75 is what's showing for motor temp. It might go down the longer we sit here, as long as we can uh, we can get moving. All right. Oh, I need to make sure to avoid this pothole coming up so our Onyx doesn't turn off again. Uh, we're at 80. 79, 80. It's 
going to be one long stretch of road so you can see how hot this thing is going to get. A lot of people don't stay on their Onyx flat out like this for long periods of time. A lot of these bikes are in New York and LA and San Francisco where the lights are very uh, compact and it's like small little streets. Showing that we're at 80. We're at 80 for the motor. Not too bad, not too bad. So we're at 89. I got off the throttle just a little bit, but still, I mean, if it's going down like that, that's pretty good. Like I'm on it consistently. Every single time I hit a four-way stop, I'm trying to just move and full throttle it. Still got my blinker on. 94. So 90, uh, no, still 94. I saw 97 for a second, but it was like real quick and went right back down. So, all right, at least no one will be behind me. Oh, we're gonna go uphill. So we're at, uh, now we're at 96, 97. Uphill, full throttle. Five miles into the ride. 97, 98. think it's going to depend on your ambient temperatures outside last video we did I believe it was 70 outside and I think we were I think we were around 70 I don't know somewhere around there All right, pay attention to this time. It's 12.43. I'm going to check back with the temperature in a little bit. Stick with me. What up, Eddie? What's going on? Okay. If you guys can see that, it is 12.52 now. And the motor temp has went down to 74 to 75 degrees in that amount of time. All right, so we are at 105 for the time. And we are down to 64 on the motor temp from the bike just sitting here. 
again it's 105